Hello my fellow fans, today's news. Royal experts have branded Meghan Markle an outrageous bully for her alleged antics against the royals. Royal expert and commentator Dan Wooten issued these claims saying, one staff member branded Harry and Meghan outrageous bullies to another colleague when they were considering quitting, who replied, that's so dreadful and they are bullies. During their time in the royal family, a host of staff members left the employ of Harry and Meghan. They include private secretaries Samantha Cohen and Amy Pickerel, two PAs including Melissa Tubati and two nannies. At least 10 former staff members were reported to want to give evidence to the formal investigation into the palace's handling of complaints about Meghan's alleged bullying, the findings of which have been hushed up by Buckingham Palace once again. It's the courtiers who find themselves silenced. That's not the case for Meghan, who described the bullying allegations as a calculated smear campaign. Meanwhile, Meghan Markle has come under fire and has been accused of being careless about the impact she has over King Charles' monarchy. Royal commentator and journalist Jonathan Sacredotti issued these allegations against Meghan Markle. He was also quoted saying, I do think that Meghan came to the royal family as an older age than some non-royal spouses to do with an experience of fame and how to deal with the press and publicity that came from a different background, that of acting and modeling rather than royalty. So even though there are other non-royals who have married into the royal family, they tended not to come from that sort of background. So I think that in Meghan's case, it would be fair to say that her experience is of getting notoriety and fame and celebrity through tried and tested means and that they don't necessarily work very well for the royal family. Now those who don't like her might say that she's deliberate about it, now and she doesn't maybe care about the damage it might do to the royal family. Others might say, hmm, she doesn't realize the difference, and by her own admission, if you take her words at face value, she said in previous interviews that she didn't understand how the British tabloids and the royal family worked when she entered into this. And so maybe she didn't realize how this worked in the UK and internationally when it comes to royalty. Either way, I think there is an admission on her part in the past that she didn't know how the royals worked with the press and then as she actually got to learn them, she didn't like it. Alright guys, that's all for today. Let me know what you think. Leave your comments below, like and subscribe for more and goodbye for now.